As always, we have team coverage on the coronavirus in Oregon tonight. We begin with KZI 9 News reporter Jacob Roberts, who joins us live from Springfield, where one business has found itself facing scrutiny from state regulators after random spot checks were done just last weekend. And Jacob, the Brick House Gentlemen's Club uh, is one of nine businesses in our area being investigated. Is that right? Yeah, that's right, Jillian. The Oregon Liquor Control Commission says when they visited this location over the weekend, there were too many people and not enough social distancing. They said the dancers were getting too close to the customers. They weren't wearing masks and neither were the other staff or the customers inside. As we've reported, state officials visited over 800 businesses during the July 4th weekend. I visited two of the nine businesses that may have violated the rules in our area today. Both have signs on the door saying masks are required. An employee at Brick House tells me they're aware of the allegations. Over in Cottage Grove, the Bohemian Tavern also under investigation. Officials say they found little social distancing. Customers at the bar area which is not allowed, no plexiglass at the bar, and no mention of staff using masks. Still, the OLCC said these businesses are the exception, not the norm, and many in the community agree. Businesses are doing a really good job, I think, and all the stores we've seen in Springfield, it's been um, signs saying wear masks and hand sanitizer has been available almost everywhere. The OLCC says just 1% of the businesses that their inspectors visited had problems. Those concerns are now being forwarded on to Oregon OSHA to investigate. Once that investigation is complete, it would be up to OSHA to then issue any fines to those businesses. We're live in Springfield. Jacob Roberts, KEZI 9 News.